that school uniform is a liberalized business. It is going to create thousands and thousands, if not ten thousands, if not hundreds of thousands of jobs to our people at the bottom of the pyramid to be able to earn a living. It is better to have more people at the bottom of the pyramid making uniforms than to have two, three, or four handful of people in, in that, in that, uh, doing that business. And we believe that we will substantially contribute to awakening our economy. And actually, we talk about inclusion. We talk about the bottom up. The bottom up is starting with school uniform. We want to give those opportunities to people out there to take advantage and, and, and actually make, make these uniforms. That is number one. Two, we have agreed with the Cabinet Secretary Machogu that we will review our textbook policy again. Again, not because of the context of those textbooks, but because the structure that is in place now, again, is encouraging cartels at the expense of businesses at the bottom of the pyramid. Again, I reiterate, <coughs> this is a bottom-up government, and we need to get used to that. And my role is to ensure that the opportunities we have in this economy actually percolate down and they, they, we, we, they, they are cascaded to the bottom of the pyramid. So we will work together with my counterpart, Ezekiel Majok, to review the textbook policy, to ensure that those bookstores and those people who are down there, of course, subject to sufficient controls and, and measures to ensure that it is not abused again. But we don't want to kill businesses. We are not going to use our uniform policy to kill businesses. We are not going to use our textbook policy to kill businesses. We want Kenyans to work, to trade, to manufacture, to produce, and to own their economy.